straighten out of that other breaking news tonight. Highway 285 still closed both directions south of Conifer after this deadly crash tonight involving a semi truck. It flipped over and dumped a load of pipes and angle iron on top of five other vehicles Again, Sky Fox over that scene, which covers a wide area tonight. Fox 31 Shaw Turner looking into exactly what happened there, and she joins us live at the scene tonight. Shaw. Well, Colorado State Patrol tells Fox 31 that the truck was traveling southbound on the lanes. Right now, 285 still closed at Blackfoot Road. I'm going to step aside and give you a look. As many people are waiting to get through this roadblock, we just saw several tow trucks pass through. Now, let me give you a closer look at the scene captured by Skyfox earlier today. Now, the you can see if you look closely, the cab of the truck is intact. When the truck rolled, it dumped pipe and angle iron on top of those five cars, striking one of the drivers. That person pronounced dead at the scene. Matt Olson tells Fox 31 he was traveling to Aspen Park when the truck went speeding out of control, whizzing right past his family. Quickly clear that he was going way faster than the rest of traffic, and he had his hazards on, and you could hear his engine just roaring as he tried to slow down, and he, people were getting out of his way, and he was obviously doing his best to avoid uh, other cars and other people. Yeah, and right now what we're doing is waiting for more word from Colorado State Patrol. As this investigation continues, we have no word yet on a cause or the identity of the driver killed in this terrible crash. Right now, though, uh, there's a big detour here, South Elk Road, Foxton. It's what's recommended, but if you can avoid this area, definitely do that. State Patrol says this will be an extended closure tonight.